I am having some serious issues with YouTube. <laughs> It appears that every time I make a comment on one of my own videos, all the comments disappear. And I know I've gotten some comments on my videos, so I apologize if you're not getting any responses from them. I am responding, you're just not seeing them. I know because I can't see them either, neither can my husband who does all the editing, neither can anybody else who looks at the videos. I have no idea what YouTube's up to, but if you want to contact me, Go out for a beer. I know at least one of you has, uh, at least one of you has expressed an interest in that. I would love to go to Seven Devils, have a beer. If you could look at the about section on my YouTube channel and just email me at that address, let me know what time evenings are great for me. Now that July 4th is over, I've pretty much got the rest of the summer to myself, except for, uh, this wreckage back here which is what I'm doing today. I'm going to clean up and uh, get ready for hydroponics. bags. This is the greenhouse shell, which you're not going to need for a while. I hope there's never a knife around when you need one. scissors around either. Dang it. So many cardboard boxes, so little time. Project for another day. This needs to stay. This goes. This stays because without this, I have no protection for the TV. Should we choose to move? Uh, greenhouse. Fan boxes. Wheels, which I need to keep for the living. This really is more just about moving stuff around than actually cleaning up. It's not too bad in here, although it needs a sweep out. going back in here.
technically it's okay. There's a path. Well, can you tell the difference? I may hold the world record in box stacking, but uh, don't quote me on it. The important thing is, now I've got space. I've got plenty of space over here. I've got that uh, lovely aisle way, all the way to the, uh, to the hot water heaters. Okay, so I didn't put out all the trash. Don't, uh, don't beat me up over that one because all we've got is one tiny little trash can. And uh, I'm not actually sure that you can go to the dump without a car, which means I'd have to rent a truck, which means I'd have to spend money. And that's, uh, that's hard. But I do have, I have plenty of space along this wall now to, uh, to set up a hydroponic system. And since it's prime day, I think maybe I'll go, uh, I'm looking for a birthday present for myself. Ah, oh. and have some sun tea. Check out what I found. for boxes like we get paid for the uh, cans and bottles out here. But then I suppose we'd have to pay a deposit to Amazon every time we ordered something. A race against time this morning. Oh, don't fall over coffee cup because that light down there and up there will soon be down here and I want to get rid of some of this stuff. Let's see if I can do it. New gloves? I know they don't look new because they've already been used. I bought them new. season stinky bob stinks so bad if I get it now it'll come back a little less next year Oh, 
when they redid this fence line, they ruined some of the uh, carpet, which had the intention of fixing this problem. And made it much worse. So what's really weird is uh, on dandelions, Roundup makes pulling them much easier, but it makes pulling Stinky Bob even worse. dandelions but makes pulling them much easier ah that's a good one we just give up the ghost to squat, not bend over. Gotta get my squats in. Ooh. No. No, no. Looks like I'm gonna have to do a third spraying.
pretty good. That is pretty good. Why do I always think that things are going to take longer than they actually do? Yes, it's not perfect, but you know, at least it's uh, it's knocked down. Yeah, knocked down into there. Uh, and again, I have a problem with trash, but uh, I'll rake that over onto the side of the house and just leave it be. Yep. Still got a lot of work to do here, but uh, this is going to have to be sprayed again. And then I got to wait for the rain before I can actually uh, take those out. They're, they're pretty, these are pretty wedged in here now. Yeah. yeah. I'll wait till it rains and then I'll go at it again. So, what do I do now that I've got, uh, got the garage done and I got uh, a batch of weeding done? Oh no. I guess I'm going to have to go back to my day job. So, the question remains <clears throat> am I a farmer? Absolutely not. This year was a total bust for the, for the uh, farming goal. Am I a gardener? <laughs> I, I think it's pretty borderline right now whether I'm a gardener or not. I definitely don't have the amount of tools or inputs that could really, you know, show me off as a gardener. If, if you're going by containers, maybe the one corner that I have fixed in the front, maybe. I do some weeding, but eh. So what am I doing? Well, until I can actually get into some hydroponics this winter and get stuff into the greenhouse, uh, there's really no way for me to start farming again. So this July, my husband being the wonderful person that he is, actually got me the perfect birthday present. So stick around for Bonsai Diaries. I love Bonsai and I have made a start. I've got a couple of plants that are Bonsai worthy but haven't quite gotten there yet and these are just little teeny tiny babies. See you soon. Thank you.